Right, uh, what we've got here is the Texicom uh, Ricochet Matrix uh, Analyzer. Uh, it's, there's no uh, GDPR here, this is my home system, so this is the only way I can really show you what's going on on the system. So it's just initiated to 10%, and you can see already that. Uh, most of the detectors, well all the detectors see back to the centre receiver and the detectors can see at least one other detector at this point in time. Now as the matrix builds up and time goes by we'll see that figure at the bottom of the um, screen changing as you can see here. It's now seeing two detectors, so it can hop onto two other detectors. That's why it's got four detectors. Um, so it can hop onto any of the other detectors should there be a obstruction, um, something interfering with it, uh, etc. It can't see the detector. Um, so basically, it will look and hop to other routes. And this is the Texicom Matrix system. Uh, ricochet system, sorry. Okay, let's see what we got. Um, so, I can't quite see that. It's at 50% at the moment. So, at 50%, it'll probably see quite a bit, but it still ain't finished. It's going to analyse all the matrix and give us a more accurate figure. It does take time. Yeah, to get the matrix working as well, you do have to take the um, leader off the receiver, and that puts it into learn mode. Then you can put your um, Texicom uh, WinTech software onto it, and you can open your uh, Ricochet software within the WinTech, and this is what you can see at the moment on my screen. So on my home system, I've got a Texicom Premier Elite 48. I've got a 8-zone um, expander for the wireless just to cover the conservatory area and the, um, the front of the house where the detector is always going to go. Um, it will act as a matrix system, it will act as a mesh system. You can see the mesh on these unlike a lot of other um, systems out there. This will actually show you where it can actually see. So I have got situations where I've got 80 odd detectors on one receiver and about 40 odd detectors on another. Uh, both receivers are down by the control panel because there was a bit of an issue when they were separated. Uh, in a nutshell, even though the house is massive, it doesn't cause a problem. It will actually see and hop enough times without hopping too, you know, it can't hop more than four times. But all of them um, hop all the way back to the control panel and I think there's only two that don't hop back to the control panel they come right off um, existing detectors but that's fine because of the amount of coverage in there so as you can see this network's built up um, yeah okay so it, it's built up you've got a solid um, lines at the bottom that's it uh, any questions just give me some uh, comments and stuff like that and I'll be happy to oblige and come back to you.